Hello friends, Radhika Ravikum here. So in this tutorial, we'll see what are views in uh, SQL. So for the first thing about view is it's a database um, object. That is, when we say database object itself, it means that the view is actually stored in the database till we drop the view. Then uh, the, the this database object will uh, provide a restricted access to the um, table on which we have created the view. So the view is also called as uh, virtual table or else you can even call it as a mirror uh, mirror image um, of a table ok so this is what uh, whenever um, uh, we want to know like what is view it means that the database object uh, which, will, uh, which will provide a uh, you know restricted um, access to the table data and also we can say that the view is a virtual table uh, or is a mirror image of a table ok. Now let us uh, just uh, go and create a view. In order to create a view uh, first uh, let me uh, select the employee data ok. Now I am going to create a view on this employee table for that you just need to say create view then give view name I will just mention it as view employee underscore view you can give any name you want then say as then select star from employee where department equal to 20 ok. So, the view is created you can see now if you want to see the data in the view then uh, select star from give the view name this emp underscore view. So you can see only the uh, the query result is uh, is in is present in this um, employee underscore view, but actually what happens is whenever we query from a view, that is uh, when we say select star from employee underscore uh, or if you are doing any uh, you know query on this uh, view, actually the query is uh, fired against the base table. Base table means um, this is our base table because the main table is called the base table. So, this is the view and uh, the query is actually fired against the base table and will uh, and uh, fetches the data from the base table rather than uh, performing the you know the fetching of data from the view. Actually uh, in the data is not present in the view that means it's just uh, it just points to the data the base or sorry, the base table whereas actual data is not present in the view you need to remember this. So, this is the one point that you need to remember and another thing is um, uh, the as I said the view which is our which are like whichever view is created on this table the table that table is called as the base table and also the each table can have any number of views you want can create n number of views and as well as um, whenever uh, we are like dropping a view then the base table does not get affected whereas uh, when we are dropping the base table the actual view does not get dropped but it becomes invalid that is see whenever uh, we are like uh, dropping the base table the view becomes um, sorry base table the view becomes uh, invalid that is it does not get dropped it becomes invalid but when we drop the view drop the view the base table is not affected ok is not uh, affected ok whereas the view just gets dropped. So, this what is about uh, views and the advantages of view uh, coming to advantages um, mainly the view is used for uh, security purpose that is uh, uh, whenever um, you the view actually the view does not um, uh, store the sorry actually the view is mainly used for security purpose then another thing is um, the view does not store any data as I said uh, so there is no memory consumption and as well as um, that is it does not uh, store any does not store any data. So, no memory 
the memory does not get occupied. So, this is the another uh, advantages. So, let me mention it as advantages of you. then uh, um, some more advantages is um, it mainly it uh, as i said security it means that it protects the base table that means whenever uh, we are like uh, we want to expose when we are exposing the view name to the user uh, the base table is not actually shown to the user only the view name is shown to the user so act the the user will actually uh, will, will not know uh, what is the name of the base table but he'll just you know do the querying and all on the view itself so, so that it it's like a, it's providing a security to our uh, base table. So, this is what is about security. Then uh, another advantage is like uh, the view will provide uh, us the column level, row level, and uh, table table level uh, access to our uh, table data. And uh, also, any complex or long queries can be stored within a view for easier references. So, these are the advantages. So, hope uh, you have understood. In the next tutorial, uh, we will uh, see the types of views that are available in SQL and we will see how we can create those uh, types of views also. Hope you have enjoyed the tutorial. Thank you very much for watching.